So Mr. Hop's Playhouse is back. Looks like I have to deal with the evil Easter Bunny again. What is going on, TFG Squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome to Mr. Hop's Playhouse 2. So I played the original game like two years ago on my channel, and then, like I said, I had 150 comments from you guys telling me number two's here. I'm going to go with a new game. Let's just get started. Keep your noise levels as low as possible. So I do remember the faster you run, I run with shift. Uh, e to open doors, uh, shift to run, space to jump. This game is so much fun. If you want to see more games like this on the channel, don't forget to hit that like button and make sure you subscribe right now. I feel like Mr. Hop is going to start coming after me soon. I am just waiting for it. Oh, I don't like open hallways because usually that means he's about to come after me. Nope. Oh, it's literally uh, just a dead end. That was not there when I first came by. That was not there. Do I? Oh, man. It's, yep, it's Mr. Hop. Hi, Mr. Hop. Oh, you look a little stronger than you were originally. Wait, what? Run? Oh, this, okay, he's chasing me, right? Oh my gosh, okay, I gotta run, I gotta run, I gotta run. What did I do? Oh, maybe that was what it... Esther, maybe... we are trying to sleep. Sorry. Blacklands Manor Orphanage, United Kingdom, 1952. You woke us all up again. Did you have a bad dream again, Esther? It's not just a bad dream, Isaac. It's the same dream, over and over again. Maybe it means something? Maybe it means you're going crazy. <laughs> I am well, not very crazy, nice. Molly. Here you are, kids. More things for you to make a mess with. <gasps> New toys! Oh, Mr. Hop is there, and now he's got friends. He's got friends now. Oh, gosh. Yep. Yep. That is an evil toy, all right. She's not crazy. This before. These are quite creepy looking. No, they're not. They're adorable. <gasps> Molly's gonna I'm be the first one to be dead. Miss Bow. I'll call mine Mr. Stripes. What are you going to call yours, Esther? Don't name Mr. it. Mr. Hop. Oh, that's the name you gotta go with. You couldn't have named it like Mr. Bunny. Okay, so that was the intro. This is gonna be awesome. Chapter one, hide and seek. Oh man. So this is the full length game. Follow Molly and Esther. I don't know where Molly and Esther are right now. Oh, sorry. so this is the orphanage right now. I usually don't want to press the toys, but I guess there's no toys for me to touch right now. Esther, down here. Okay, I guess I'm following Isaac and Molly. Uh, which direction were you coming from, Isaac? Would you mind calling me one more time? Oh, jeez, I do not like the cracks in the walls. I'm gonna run a little bit because my sound levels are low right now. Oh, oh, here they are, here they are. Uh, finally. Do you want to play hide and seek with us? That wouldn't be fair. You can see Esther's big head from anywhere. You are so funny, Molly. Hmm, <laughs> don't forget beautiful and clever. <laughs> you go count by the lift. We will hide in the library. Okay, what did I do to make Molly so mean? All right, I'm going to go to the left and count. I have a feeling they're going to get taken by, what was it? Mrs. Bo and Mr. Stripes. These kids are not very creative when it comes to naming things. Although I'm not very creative when it comes to naming things either. All right, what's this? This lift has been out of order for two weeks. Please telephone an engineer, Bev. Oh, okay, that's fantastic. Three, two, one. Coming, ready or not. Mr. Hop, you wait here. Oh, jeez. Okay, new object added. What was the new object that I just got? Play hide and seek. Not, not exactly a new object. Oh, new objective. I'm so stupid sometimes. I'm yelling at the game and I'm just the one that can't read. Okay, so they are gone. Oh, I can actually go in there. Oh, see, so they said they were going to go in the library. So here's Mrs. Bo and Mr. Stripes. Can I talk to them? No, apparently not. Okay, this game has been going way too well so far. I have a feeling things are about to go badly. Oh, oh, I see one of them. Oh, not there. Sorry, Isaac. Jeez. Okay, that was... Is that it? Am I... Am I supposed to talk to him anymore? No, that... That's it. Okay, so I think we're literally just looking for them. Maybe they haven't gotten, you know, abducted yet. Oh, wait. There she is. As usual, I was the best at hiding. No, you weren't. Don't think you're allowed to move to different hiding spots. It's not fun playing with a cheat. A cheat? You two are lucky. I am even uh -oh. playing with you right now. Can we please keep the noise down? Don't you know this is a library? Yes, You're the one please. screaming. Jeez, okay. Children. It's not like anybody else is in here. We can go somewhere else. 
I'll go get Mr. Hop. Okay, new objective added. Not an object, it's an objective. Uh, get Mr. Hop. Oh boy, I have a feeling this is when the game's really gonna begin. Oh, what was that? I saw something. I just saw a ghost of some sort. Okay, Mr. Hop is probably... Oh, he has been... Uh... I must have left you too close to the edge. No, no. That's absolutely not what happened there. Okay, chapter two, the hunt. Okay, Mr. Hop is staring at me in the middle of my sleep and one of his eyeballs is moving. Okay, new objective added. Find Mr. Hop. Don't wake the others. Okay, so I think now I'm not able to step on the toys. So let's kind of do a little, uh, let's run, hop. Oh, run, hop. Okay, run, hop. Oh, wait, there's Miss Bo. Okay, so I guess this is Molly's bed. Run, hop, run, hop. And then there's Mr. Stripe. So that's got to be Isaac's bed. Huh. Okay, we're going to keep going through here. So far, so good. I saw Mr. Stripes walk by. What does it say? Matrons are patrolling the halls. Avoid being caught. I couldn't read the rest of that, but that's okay. Okay, there's a little note. Oh, and there's actually a, a, a coin. How do I get up there? Can I, can I crawl? Well, let's read the note first. All vinyl records. Oh, vinyl records to be returned here, please. Matron Muriel. So I guess if we find a vinyl record, we'll bring it back here. Can I go get the, uh, can I move this thing? Can I move this? Yes, I can. Okay. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, and then maybe we can- oh. Wait, I can't jump on it? Oh, I can move this too? So maybe I can jump on the chair and then get on the table? Oh, I got it! I- okay, you know what? That's fine. That is a-okay. Let's get out of this room. It was freaking me out anyway. Why is there a little mouse there? Oh! I feel like the mouse is probably gonna go and yell at me and tell Mr. Hop. So I see- oh, that's not Mr. Hop! That's not Mr. Hop! This is a creepy orphanage, man. I mean, have they, has there ever been an orphanage in the world that wasn't creepy? That's probably the question to ask. Hello! Hello! Okay, um, I think I'm cornered right now, so I'm gonna go downstairs and hopefully not get caught. Oh man, they are chasing me around. Okay, I don't know who's scarier, Mr. Hop or those th matrons or whatever they are that are coming around me. Oh, I recognize that sound anywhere I go! That was Mr. Miss Bo. That was Mrs. Bo. Okay, so Mrs. Bo and Mr. Stripes are now evil too. Apparently all of them are evil. I think there were five stuffed animals. So something tells me there's going to be five of them that can come after me and kill me. Please clean up after yourselves. If you use the kitchen the sink, thank you, Matron Ruth. Okay, I don't really like the matrons. They seem kind of mean. You feel like, oh, there's Mr. Hop. Okay. Uh, how did you get all the way down here? Uh, believe me, he didn't fall. He did not fall. He was taken here. Okay, I got another coin. Oh, what's this over here? Uh, can I go up here? Uh, I- Okay, I guess that's just the kitchen sink. I don't really know what that's for. Okay, my next objective just says get back to the children's room. And I have four coins right now, which is pretty good. Oh, and you can actually kind of see I'm like 80 steps away from the children's room. Things are really going fantastically. I don't know what you're playing at, Esther. If I catch you out of bed again, you'll be spending the night in the cellar. Do I make myself clear? Yes, Crystal clear. Yes, crystal clear. Thank bed. you. Now. Okay. I don't really want to be up here anyway. Thank you, Miss Beverly. Can you can you walk away? Uh, don't, don't you have to go to the bathroom? No, you're just going to stare at me. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Uh, let's do this. Let's do this, this, oh, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Okay, chapter three, the six. Oh, wouldn't that be chapter six? Oh, I see eyes. Don't you even pretend that you don't see eyes there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. yes, I was just scared by a chandelier falling from the sky. I don't, oh my gosh, and now I see Mr. Hop staring at me. I guess I'm gonna have to go in there. And there are now spikes on the ground. Oh my gosh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Huh. Hello, Mr. Hop. I see your eye sticking out of a wall. That actually seems really painful to stick your eye through a wall. What's this? Oh. Oh, okay. So this is like a symbol. I guess I need to collect six of them. So far, I got one. Usually, you can kind of see him walking and you can kind of hear him too. Like right now, it sounds like he's on my left. There he is. Hello, Mr. Hop. I really like your uh, red bow tie. It's... It suits you very well. Okay, let's keep running. Why does he have an eye here? Let's go up. Oh, wow. He is really fast at some points. Mr. Hop seems like he's on my left. Let's go down. Oh, my gosh. Okay, this is so scary. This is so scary. Uh, I need to keep my noise levels low. I don't think he's here right now. Okay, this is the next symbol. I got two out of the six right now. I am a third of the way done. Is there one in the bathroom? 
No, there's not, but there is a coin. There are spikes from the ground. Okay, that is something that we need to deal with. And Mr. Hop, if you think I don't see you right now, you're even dumber than I thought. You were! I got spiked in the butt cheeks. Yep, I literally just got spiked in the butt cheeks. Where is the next symbol? I've only gotten two out of the six so far, and I have no idea. I feel like I've searched this entire area. I keep spiking myself. Oh, this is not good. Oh, this is the next spike. Okay, or the next symbol. I don't even know what I'm talking about. Oh, my health is really low. My health is concerningly no low, and now there are fists punching from the sky. Because why not? That, that seems like a very reasonable thing to do. Mr. Hop was definitely there. I gotta keep my sound levels low. I keep running a little bit too much. Hey, Mr. Hop, hope you're having a great day. I'm not. It's kind of your fault that I'm not having a great day. We got four out of the six. This is a tough level, guys. This is probably supposed to be the easy part, and I'm making it look hard. Oh, now they're swinging axes as if the hands and the spikes weren't enough. This is... Oh, this is tough. Wait a second. This is gonna be really tough. Ready? Steady. Go. Don't get hit by the spikes. Oh, that was actually pretty good. All right, we're up on the third floor. So Mr. Hop is coming back. I have to remember that I can crouch, too. Okay, so let's go here. Let's jump. Let's crouch. I, I, oh, I, I actually did that. Okay, this one's actually under the thing. Oh, okay. I got five out of the six symbols. I need to find one more. Just one more. Even I can find one more symbol, right? Oh, here it is. Here it is. I got it. I got it. I got it. Well, now what do I do? Objective? They're not going to give me an objective. Is Mr. Hop gone? It sounds like something is burning. Did somebody leave a hot pocket in the microwave too long again? Oh, now the burning sound is getting louder. Okay, I can see it. I literally keep running into spikes because I'm stupid sometimes. Okay, is there anything in here? Let's just check. Nope, definitely not. Oh, boy. Can we do something? I need to put this fire out before the whole house is burnt down. Ooh. Oh, let's not run into the fire, Brandon. That would probably be a smart idea to not run into the fire. How am I supposed to get the fire out? Is there, like, some sort of a fire extinguisher? Also, that fire is massive. I, I don't think I'm going to be able to put that out by myself. I think you should probably call 911. Whoa. I saw another ghost, but there is a coin. Oh, here's a bucket. Aha. I don't know how I missed that. I'm pretty sure I checked that room before, but you know what? That's okay. All I have to do is not hit the stupid spikes. All right. I think the sink was on this floor. Okay, here we go. So can I fill it with water? Yes, I can. Again, that was a massive fire. There is no way a tiny little bucket like this is going to put out the fire, but something tells me it probably will. Uh, oh, Brandon, don't you get yourself killed now. There's not even an evil bunny chasing me right now, and I'm hitting the cars. This is, this is just not going well. Okay, how do we... There we go. That was the most powerful bucket of water in the history of buckets of water. What is this thing? Okay, okay. Another bad dream. You know what? Maybe all of this is fake. Maybe maybe Esther or whatever her name is just dreaming all of this. Chapter 4, Molly. If you want to see more of this game, let me know in the comments. Don't forget to hit that subscriber button and check out my vlog channel, guys. TFG Vlogs on YouTube. Go there and subscribe to that channel. And I will see all of you in the next video.